Here you see an access device for a patient who has um, kidney failure and requires hemodialysis. Um, one of the lines or catheters is going to take the dirty blood away from the body so it can be cleaned in the artificial kidney or the dialysis machine. And the other line brings the clean blood back into the body. And so whenever someone ends up on hemodialysis, it's because their kidneys have failed. And again, the kidneys, they clean, they filter, and they also remove the extra fluid. So when your kidneys stop working, we have to use a machine in order to sustain your life. And that machine is called the hemodialysis machine. Patients usually require hemodialysis three times per week and each session can take three to five hours. In addition, they have to limit their phosphorus, their sodium, their potassium, and their fluids, otherwise they can make their situation worse. If you're interested in learning more about renal failure, about hemodialysis, or about how to become an organ donor, please go to kidney.org. This is Nurse Eunice, everybody. Be blessed.